Drake is denying rumors from a woman who claims the rapper flew her out for a romantic night, but then kicked her out once she started recording him. The Canadian rapper issued a statement Wednesday on Instagram, apparently addressing the woman's TikTok video about the alleged encounter. Drake wrote, never met, never spoke, never flew. He added, I hope people start doing more with the one life we are given. Shit is sad out here. In her TikTok video, the woman states that Drake DM'd her after she posted a story mentioning the music icon while she was in a lingerie. She says they began talking, which led to Drake booking her flight to see him. Before anything went down between them, Drake made her sign an NDA, so she claims. Just watch the video. So last month, Drake had flew me out. So I have made a video and I posted it on my Instagram story. It was a video of me inside a purple lingerie set. And I had tagged Drake inside my story, but I tagged him and I like made it real small so nobody could know that I had tagged him in my story. So I did not know that he was going to even seek it. I'm not even going to lie. So he had texted me in vanish mode and was like, what's your number? With the hard eyes emoji. So I sent my number quick. So he called my phone, we chopped it up or whatever, and that's when he was like, he trying to see me, and I was like, I'm trying to see you too. So he had booked my flight for the November 16th. Mind y'all, we texting, talking, all of that, November 13th. So fast forward, I got off the plane, he had sent a private out to get me, but before I went inside his house, they made me sign an NDA. So I can't really say too much, but I had looked up my NDA rules, so I know what I can and can't say. You feel me? So when I get in the house, we just sitting on the couch, chilling, talking. He kept on rubbing on my stomach and kept on asking questions like, do you want kids? And I'm like, what you trying to say? Like, if you want if you want a baby mama, me, just say that. <laughs> he just kept on rubbing on my stomach, asking me, do I want kids? I was like, yeah, I want one. I want a little boy. So we watch a movie. We drinking Casamigos. Then y'all know. Casamigos bring out the freak up. <laughs> so y'all know we did what we did. I don't have to go in detail about that because it's self-explanatory. But he did not use protection, which was a little weird. But y'all know I'm just going with the flow. So after we did what we did, we just cuddling and we're watching another movie. So everything went left when I pulled my phone out. So I had pulled my phone out and I had recorded him. And as soon as he seen me recording him, he slapped my phone out my hand. I'm not even going to lie. I got a little scared because that slap was aggressive. But after he had slapped the phone out my hand, he was like, you got to go. I was like, just because I recorded you, really? But I had posted the video on my Instagram. All the receipts is on my Instagram, so I don't got time for y'all to be like, I'm lying and all of that. Because what do I have to lie for? At one point in the video, she says he kept on rubbing on my stomach and asking me questions like, do you want kids? She went on to say that they started drinking and vibing, and eventually things escalated to them having unprotected sex. The woman also claims Drake became angry when she began recording him, saying she slapped her phone out of her hand and kicked her out. Of course, the woman's video went viral, but a clip has been deleted now that Drake has entered the conversation, calling bullshit on her accusations. But the woman insists she has proof that what she says about Drake is true. I will keep an eye for those receipts. Let me know what you think in the comments down below.